Come on in, welcome. Hi. Thank you. What is happening, buddy? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for joining me on another garage sale adventure. Today we are giving you footage just from one single sale. This sale is so incredible that we have a full video just of it. It's a rummy sale that happened here in my area. I spotted the sign accidentally while driving home from the gym. I saw a sign and it said church rummer sale. Love those signs. And it said uh, $5 entry on Thursday night and then the rest of the people get free entry on Friday morning. You best believe I was there Thursday night with five hours in hand. I got there very early. I was like the fourth in line. There was probably like 50 or 60 people after me in line. So a lot of people knew about the sale and wanted to be there. As you'll see, we find some incredible items. This sale just happened a couple weeks ago and a lot of stuff already sold. Uh, but did I make, make a mistake? You'll see me talk about it at the end of uh, something I should have went to first that I will know for the future as well. But besides that, it was a great sale. I uh, hope you guys sit back, relax, and enjoy everything that we find. How much are your shoes? I'm not in this apartment. Yeah. <laughs> How much are the shoes? Um, there's a sign Men's right there. Dollar and a half, women's are dollar okay. and a half, kids are dollar. Thank you. Tables is already marked. Okay, I see that. Yeah. Okay, and this is a hodgepodge table. If you see some little things that you want on here, you can Just put them in a bag. For Perfect. A Thank you. This also includes the books. Glad you're here. Thank you for coming. <laughs> I saw a sign. <laughs> oh, good. We have, oh, these are some beautiful things. Yeah. We also have little jackets. Oh, yeah. Little jacket. And youngsters' clothing is over there. Well, Mickey ears. Yeah. Yes. Oh, we have. Um, I have another one. The reindeer. Some place here. So all the plushies that you see me pick up are, are sold on my whatnot shows. I do winner's choice uh, plush lots on my on my shows where I bring up six or seven plushes at a time and I do winner's choice and whoever wins picks one of the plushes they want. It's a really fun way for me to sell the plushies. I make a decent profit on them and my buyers get a great plush as well. These are uh, Funko Pop Hallmark little mini bitty poppies. I actually bought a bunch of these before and did a whatnot show just for them. If they said a dollar on them, I probably would have bought every single one. But they had three dollars on them and in my last show on whatnot, I sold them for about four to seven dollars each. At three bucks, the profit just wasn't there on them for me to buy them at that. But if they were a dollar, I would have bought every single one. I did buy every single one of these though. These are Walmart Hallmark uh, ornaments. They're so cool. They got different characters on them. They got like uh, Dragon Ball Z, Disney, Snoopy, Nightmare Before Christmas, and Ninja Turtles. Like so many cool characters on them. I bought every single one of these. I brought them to my whatnot shows. I'm going to be doing different lots. So far I sold two lots. This lot of seven for $15. This lot of five for $18. And I still have enough for two to three more lots to sell as well. I'm very happy with the profit on them and they're a fun item in my whatnot auctions.
laying here. Hi, Diane. Hi. I'm going to quickly go through the clothing section. You guys know my animosity to this clothes, but when they are so cheap, I do buy them. I'm actually looking for just graphic tees here or just like some jeans because I do bundles like that on my whatnot. Uh, if you got like graphic tees, I do graphic tee bundles starting at $5. And I usually bring at least 10 shirts. So it's a really good bang for your buck. I am also starting to bring jean bundles, short bundles, polo bundles, button down bundles, uh, all these other bundles of clothes that I don't like to list, but I pick up because they're so cheap and I want them to give them to you at a discount and so that you guys can sell them and make a ton of money and I'm happy making a quick nickel as well. Oh yeah. Would you like the egg? example of what I'm talking about. That is a Fat Face, uh, the Archie, uh, I think it's the brand of a quarter zip button, uh, uh, quarter zip uh, sweatshirt. That shirt sells for about $40 on eBay. I paid a dollar for it at the church sale. I think I sold it for $8 on my whatnot. So I made seven bucks with almost no effort at all. And whoever has bought it, bought it for seven bucks and you can sell it for 40. I can see that as a win-win for all of us. That's why I love whatnot so much. I have finally made it to the hat section uh, of the sale and uh, as you see it seems like it's been picked over or just didn't have anything too good to begin with. I'm looking at all of them but I don't really see anything that I like too much. I think I found like one or two hats here out of all of them. Um, I think they're asking a buck a hat or two bucks, bucks a hat, uh, I, I don't remember. I think I bought like one or two hats only. The rest of them just were meh. Now what I'm looking for, not something that I can sell online or on whatnot either. So guys, here's my biggest mistake with this rummage sale is that they had a big rummage sale open area like this and then they have a boutique section that you're about to see me go into right here. So the boutique section, when you hear the word boutique, you know, it sounds pretty bougie, sounds pretty expensive. So I avoided it. You know, I went to the other section first, but I was like, okay, I, I think I shopped everywhere else. Let me check out this boutique section. And guys, look at what's in this boutique section and the prices they're asking for them. They're asking $3, $5 for boutique stuff. And I was like, man, I should have gotten in here first. That would have definitely cleaned out. But even though I got here late, I still found all these incredible items right here. <laughs> Out this register, okay. okay? 
If they're not marked, is there a price one? Or? Some aren't marked. It should be. These should be marked. I believe that they're these like these. Either. These are five. I know that. Okay. So these probably are five because all the new ones, the newer ones like that, are all five. Sounds good. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Please. This one right Thank you, thank you. Yep. You got it? I do. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I'll make my way. So I'm waiting to check out and in, uh, in line for the boutique uh, shop because they had different checkout places for boutique and then for the rest of the, of the sale. Lady in front of me is holding a green box and that green box is a pair of Gucci shoes. The Gucci shoes were in the boutique section and they were only asking $10 for them. And she got there right before I got to the boutique section and grabbed them for $10. Again, if I went to the boutique sections first, those would have been mine and probably a bunch of the great stuff that I missed out. So like in the future, when I go to the sale, I'm going to the boutique section first. You know, that's just bags. Oh, okay. So $10, this is yours too? Yeah. And 10 and 10, so 20? I don't know. It was 20 even, right? Oh, oh, yeah, we got we need the bag if you charge you if it's not in with the with the receipt on the outside. So $80 Okay, for that. Was this marked anyway? No, it was from the pants are I can't either. There were just three, three. So four dollars for this and ten. So that's fourteen. And then what else you got? Um, three, three, and five. And these were more three. three. So nine and five. Nine and five. Fourteen. Nine and five. Twenty-eight. Twenty-eight. You got it. Brain still functions. That's good. Mine is intermittent. Did a lot of math today already. First math I'm doing. Okay, out of 30, so $2 change. It was a total of 28? Yeah. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Enjoy. Did you have anything um, from this department? No. No? Okay. Well, I decided, yeah, I just needed to ask. Thank you. Yeah. Did you have anything from this department? Besides that, no. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> besides that, no, I didn't. Besides your shoes? Besides that big bag, no, I didn't. <laughs> this is the only thing? No. Okay, so a shirt. Thank you. Thank you. Three dollars. Boy, you're doing good. Look at all these toys. You two together. Huh? Oh, thank you. Or how much? Everybody's in your way. <laughs> or maybe I'm in everyone. No, that, that could be it too. I didn't want to say it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. Okay, he's already paid for that. Alright, so we've got two hats. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. Twenty-five. And a dollar a piece. Yep. Or this bag's yours too. Can we unload that bag into this bag? That'll be a smart idea, right? That would be, be a smart way to do it. All right. Another dollar. And another dollar. Okay. Uh, a dollar. Okay. No, another dollar. Okay. Don't forget. Fifty cents. We do a quarter each. Okay. So Fifty cents. She was also a dollar, but the tag yeah. fell off. She's the same as her. Yeah, little well, Miss Piggy's a dollar. Uh, they're a dollar each. Yeah. And then one pair of shoes. Is that women's shoes? Yes, women's. And then another pair of shoes. That's it. Alright, so here we go back again. So we have two pairs of women's shoes? Uh, women's and men's, so that's the okay. same price. Yeah. That's probably the same. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They are, they're $1.50. Okay, yeah. That's everything, huh? It's really tiny you want this prints. box? No, no, no. $56.50. No change. You sure? Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. And help yourself on the way out. Thank you so much. Yep. We got big hands. No, I'm good. Uh, thank you. All right, ladies and gents, we are back in the office now. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, that video. Again, that's all just from one sale. A sale on a Thursday night of all places, too. Uh, all places, all times. I don't know why Thursday night just became a place in my mind, but that's how we function here when we have been uh, up late working all day. <laughs> Thursday night of all places. Yes, that's good English, Paul. Uh, Thursday night of all days. Uh, what a what a sale, what a sale, man. I love this about my new area here. There's so many different rummage sales happening all the time. And as you see, it just takes one of them for you to score absolutely big on. And we did that here. I dropped 60 bucks on the main one, uh, 28 in the boutique section. And pretty much everything from the boutique section sold uh, besides the Prince Fielder jersey that I just listed yesterday. I did a big batch of clothes listing yesterday, so that one just got listed. All the shoes sold, the on cloud show sold, the what do you want, the Tivas with the other ones? Tivas sold, the Hey Dude sold on my whatnot, and what was the fourth pair? A uh, North Face, all those boots sold, uh, all the shoes sold, and so there was a big gap of missing shoes there. So, like I said, if I got there first, I probably would have cleaned up even bigger got all the gucci's and all that stuff but hey whatever it is what it is we i'm still very happy for the stuff that i got like i said in the future i'll know when that sale is happening go to the boutique section first of all go there first go there first go there first um yeah so there you have it that and the great sale um awesome 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 um before i sign off just want to say a huge thank you to all of the guys uh for 
all the positive words. Well, I guess most of you guys, not all of you guys. Some of you guys still thought it would be appropriate to be nasty and rude to me on a video like that where I go really personal and share stuff that I'm kind of scared to share with the world. And you guys still thought that was a really, and some people thought that was a video. Some people thought that was a video we can go and make nasty remarks about me, about my ex and all that. And that's not what I'm here for. So I had to block a decent amount of people too with the comment section, but majority of guys, 99% of you guys were amazing and left me really nice comments and um, advice and motivation. Thank you guys all for that. I really do appreciate it. Uh, I try to respond to as much as I could. If I didn't respond to it, I did leave a heart to your comment. Just so you know that I did read it. I read every single comment on that last video. There's over like 500 comments on that video now. So there's a lot of comments to read. Uh, and it's one thing you get from the bottom of my heart. Like you guys are my family pretty much. I, it's kind of weird how, how life works. Like I haven't met almost any of you, but you guys say in your comments, like you guys treat me like I'm your son or your grandson. And just cause we built this like emotional connection bond through YouTube. And it's something when I first started my YouTube channel, I would have no clue that it would get to this point uh, of my life where I build a connection with so many of the people out there that I have never met. And it's just so wonderful. And in times like this, where I was at my lowest and I needed support, you guys came through uh, with the super nice encouraging words. And I just wanna say thank you guys, thank you. Like I said, um, I have no animosity towards Lena or anything that's happening there. I believe everything is in God's control and I fully am trusting in him. I wish nothing but the best for her. She wishes nothing but the best for me and we're just gonna keep going forward in our separate ways and um, that's how life is gonna be. But thank you guys for um, respecting my privacy and thank you guys for the nice words as well. Really does mean a lot. Anyways, that's going to be it for me, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are watching on Friday, don't forget, every Saturday I have a mega whatnot show. You guys saw a bunch of the stuff in here. I sell on whatnot every Saturday. I sell about 100 items on whatnot every Saturday, um, 7 p.m. Eastern time. If you guys want to come catch the next one, it'll be tomorrow if you guys are watching on Friday. I uh, hope to see you guys in my whatnot show. If not, I'll see you guys on Monday with another video. Until then, here's my dog, Sasha. Peace out.